Hey, this is Brett, and today I'm at the 2022 Chicago Auto Show here in Chicago, Illinois, and just checking out any vehicles I can today, get you a good look at the new lineups, the new vehicles, the new colors, and uh, just share all the um, vehicles that are here at the auto show today. I'm, or This one I'm looking at is a 2021 Bronco Sport. This is a Big Bend Edition. Cyber orange metallic tint coat is the color. This one has the 1.5 liter turbocharged EcoBoost engine. Puts out 181 horsepower and 190 foot-pounds of torque. Uh, really a cool color, that cyber orange. It's got a lot of metal flake to it. Really a neat color. And uh, just going to go around the vehicle a little bit. Here's the original window sticker. Feel free to take a look at this and pause it. So any special packages, this one has a convenience package which gives you rear parking sensors, wireless charge pad, heated seats, LED fog lamps, and universal garage door opener, as well as the secure code keyless entry pad. I actually show you how to find that code in a video we did in the upper right hand part of the screen. And eight way power driver seat. Uh, total MSRP is 33,635. And uh, 25 city, 28 highway, average of 26 miles per gallon on this SUV, look at the safety scores on these five stars up and down the board. The only thing that didn't get five is the rollover right there. Um, I think the last time I did a Bronco Sport, they didn't have these uh, scores out yet, so that's really cool to see. Really nice to see that it's a super safe vehicle. Um, you got the projector lamp style headlamps, the LED fog lamps on there, the Bronco lettering. Somebody spilled their purple drink on there. Comes with Continental Pro Contact tires. These are 225 65R17s and the gray painted alloy rims. You get the Bronco logo in the center there. There's a look at that Big Ben logo. It's actually kind of a decal on there. Let's go take a look at the interior. All right, so you got the Big Ben edition. Uh, cloth interior on this one. You get a dark charcoal and black two-tone seat, power driver seat, uh, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. Inside, really comfortable. Has all the uh, safety features, lane departure warning right there, uh, adaptive cruise control, audio controls and normal cruise controls on the left there, uh, Bluetooth and looks like information center controls. Uh, one of the flaws on this one, or not really a flaw, but one of the knocks that it got on Edmunds is that it has the old infotainment system, so maybe they'll be updating that soon here. Got the climate controls down there, the automatic transmission, and then this one has the different uh, go over any terrain modes on there. Um, shame that they're not powered up and you can't really play with the radios or anything in here, but the headroom in this thing is amazing. I'm uh, literally about a foot my head's about a foot away from the ceiling, so the headroom in these is really nice. They're really comfortable. Um, I drove one of these. I still gotta upload that video, but um, I like the Bronco on the steering wheel. It's leather wrapped. Um, this one does have the start stop capabilities. There, your climate controls, heated seat buttons are right there. And we'll take a look at the back seats here, real quick. Oh, I got that back seat, front seat all the way up. Um, does have the latch system back here. The seats do fold down. Even with that seat all the way back like that, sorry about that, even with that seat all the way back, you can see that I was able to get that seat all the way down. Uh, the headrests are out of it, but um, pretty cool that I was able to get that down. There's the back storage area. It does come with the spare tires, so that's nice. Receiver hitch on here. Sorry about that. It 
does have the spare tire, which is nice. Um, does have the receiver hitch back here, back of parking sensors. That doesn't close right, but that's okay. Four wheel disc brakes on this vehicle. And uh, yeah, really good looking ride. I've driven one of these, like I said, and uh, thought it rode really good. I currently drive an 09 Escape and it's pretty simi similar in uh, feeling and kind of size and everything. So anyways, thanks for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe and share and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Remember to see all our videos, hashtag CAS22. Thanks for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe and share.